Well, it wasn't all that long ago that you'd need to show proof of vaccination if you wanted to walk into a restaurant in D.C., but did vaccine mandates actually work? As Fox 5's Josh Rosenthal explains live at Northwest tonight, some researchers say they aren't so sure. Guys, according to previous studies, vaccine mandates did work in some places, for instance, France, where there was a national mandate. However, researchers say that it appears as though here in the U.S., things are a little different. December of 2021, amid sky-high rates of COVID. The Omicron variant uh, has hit us um, particularly hard. D.C. announces a mandate requiring people 12 and older to show proof of vaccination when entering many D.C. businesses. Honestly, I think it's something that we should have been doing all along. But more than a year later, new research from George Mason University says D.C.'s indoor vaccine mandate did not work. COVID cases were not affected by the mandate. COVID deaths were not affected by it. And people were not more likely to get vaccinated at all in the first place. Vitor Malo came to that conclusion by comparing COVID statistics in places like D.C. to the same statistics in cities that did not implement mandates. The idea behind the mandate is more people are going to get vaccinated. Therefore, we're going to reduce the spread of COVID. That first step really didn't happen. Malo said one reason why is if people wanted to go to a restaurant but didn't want to get vaccinated, they could just hop on the metro and go to, say, Arlington. I don't know that that is the most surprising finding. There's a lot of stupid people. Uh, they don't want to have vaccinations forced on them. That was the response from most people we asked about the findings Wednesday. We also ran it by Andrew Markard, who owns two D.C. restaurants we visited during the height of the pandemic, Bukert Saloon, and Fight Club. We definitely had a few situations where, staff, or where uh, guests wouldn't come in, uh, or guests couldn't come in because they didn't have a vaccine card. But even with the new research, Market said hindsight is 2020. Nobody knew what to do. Nobody knew what was right to do. So um, now we navigated it all the best we could. And, um, and I think the mandate was the right way to go at the time. We'd hope to get DC Health to weigh in on this as well, but they did not respond to multiple requests for comment. Jim, back to you.